Good morning guys. It has been a long time since I last posted a video. I'm so sorry, but we are going through the struggle of trying to conceive and it not working and I, like last month something really emotional happened that I was like thinking should I share it should I not share but this is it this is what happens when you're trying to conceive when you had miscarriages you're just like in that emotional roller coaster and I don't want to just show the good sides because this is life this is life it has its ups and downs and I will in this video just show you what happened um, with our last cycle hey guys we have nine days DPO and I'm kind of feeling like a poking and stinging pain in my breasts I kind of don't want to give my hopes up but last time that meant that I was pregnant again so we'll see how that goes the next couple of days they're getting kind of tender but not really so I don't know what's going on crossing my fingers we have 11 DPO with tender breasts and I know it's quite early but I will take a test let's wait for about five minutes Mm. 10 BPO, not much you can see. The most nerve wracking time. Okay, so my period is due tomorrow, and since I have had so many PMS symptoms, I just thought, and two negative tests, I thought, okay, like really negative tests like okay I'm just not gonna test again because I'm just gonna get more frustrated and I just wanted to stay calm and calm down and just focus on staying positive and so I haven't taken a test yet and I thought my period is coming tomorrow and I kept I looked again at the last test that I took looked really close and now I kind of feel like I see a second line. I don't know if I'm making it up because there is a little dent in there. So, and I think right there is a line that is so extremely faint. But since I haven't tested in like two days, I don't know. I would have to wait until tomorrow. So, <sighs> see if my period comes or if I test again, we'll see. Do you see that little dent that goes in there? Yeah, I think right there is a little line, but you can't see it on camera at all. So good morning guys. It is the day my period is due. Usually I get it at night. Last time I didn't get it at night, and again this time I didn't get it at night. So I took another test to be sure to not be all crazy this day. So let's take a look at it. A bit right here. Wait. I have no clue if this is negative or positive. Well, I guess we'll wait a little longer. Okay, so I waited a few more minutes and I will look at it again. Faint line, but it is way too faint. Are you kidding me? I do see a faint line though. I don't know what this means. This is like the most emotional roller coaster ever. I didn't keep my morning urine though. I do see a faint line here, but it is extremely faint. I have a better one, these are just the cheap ones. That would mean that I have to wait until tomorrow again. Ugh. Should have kept it. 
but I definitely see a very faint line, so... <sighs> I don't know. This is so creepy. This journey is so hard, especially because I'm always so scared that my HDCG is too low, because I don't want to miscarry again. I hope I'm not making this up. Okay, if my period doesn't come today, which is going to be a really hard day for me, then I guess I will test tomorrow again, but with a better test. I might be pregnant, I might be pregnant, I might be not, I don't know. I guess I will give you an update later. Crossing my fingers. <sighs> this is so emotional. Oh. Since my husband says he sees the line under the light as well, and I'm not blind, we decided to take a more expensive one that has lines on there and test again and see what comes out of it. And if it still doesn't really show anything, we will test again tomorrow morning with a clear blue digital one. So I just tried to take a picture of it so you could see it and there you can clearly see the line better in a close-up. I guess we're pregnant again. Let's wait for that test and see what comes out of it. Nur wieder mal überfällig, ja? Na gut. Apparently not pregnant. We'll see if that is true. So the negative test was true or kind of negative. So I guess we had a fertilized egg, but it didn't really implant because I just got my period around noon time. So Yep, that's what happens. Emotional roller coaster up and down when you're not sure and this was not our month, so hopefully maybe the next cycle works for us. Every prayer is appreciated. We'll see you guys in our next video. Bye guys.